Okay, wow. Hello guys. Half of this is recent and then half of it is from, I want to say around like Black Friday. I haven't done a haul in a very long time, so I'm like kind of uncomfortable. <laughs> I feel kind of weird just showing you guys what I bought, but I also love watching these videos, so. So to start out, we're gonna do Akira. So first we have this blazer. It's called the Sunset Road Stripe Blazer. It's very good material, very thick. I wore it last night. It was very cold, but it kept me warm. Sorry, I have on workout clothes under this because I'm going to do a little exercising after. <laughs> it has a matching set of shorts, but you just have to buy it separately. So the next piece I have is this cat suit. This is called the Nevermind Feather Detail Jumpsuit. And then it, it hugs, honestly, all the perfect areas. I love the top. Um, I was going to make this a try-on haul, but I'm not going to lie. A lot of these pieces are really hard to get on. So... We're not gonna do that. And then to go with that katsu, I got this little shrug. Basically, it's a very, very, very cropped jacket. Am I doing this right? How do I hold this? She a little snug, huh? Ooh. All right, the next item that I have is this gorgeous, gorgeous fucking dress. It's skin tight, but it's very see-through. That's what I like about it, because I can just wear this with no bra and like nude colored underwear. Yeah. Yeah, see, it's pretty pretty see-through but not over the top and the cut is also kind of low but it's at the perfect spot where the girls just look i got this a little while back and i actually i still haven't worn it so next i have a two-piece set it's like kind of satin but at the same time it's a little it's a little more hard it starts with a navy blue it looks kind of black on camera but it's navy blue and then it goes to a nice little baby blue color the top is the exact same way. It starts with this navy blue color and goes into this very pretty royal blue. So then I have another two-piece set. It's a very see-through, sparkly, short sleeve. And the flow of it is just... Here are the matching pants. It's giving festival. Very, very see-through. I have worn this once to... I think I just went out somewhere in LA, but they're very, very cute. So my favorite part is the back. The pants are also very see-through. And I just wore black underwear. <laughs> Yeah, I wore a black bralette and then like black seamless underwear. It was cute. So these are two sets, but I think that I might return the other one. But just the zebra duster. I love a good brown and black combination. I personally love gold jewelry, so I just think it looks really good. And it's long sleeves as well. And then the matching piece of it is these leggings. You have to buy it separately. Same exact pattern, and these are also very see-through. I don't know what it is about me and see-through. Your girl just loves showing her booty, I guess. To be fair, I have a nice butt, so. Oh, 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 wait. What? <gasps> Bitch. It comes with built-in underwear, I think. Yeah, the underwear is built-in. What if I wanted to wear black, though? And the last thing I got from Akira is another set. These cute-ass joggers, bro. And then the matching top. But honestly, I think I'm going to be returning this and the joggers, even though they're so cute. They just fit kind of weird. Maybe I just got the wrong size. What the fuck? I already do not want to show the rest. I'm such an impatient person. So next is a store called Salado. I've been really into bodysuits and cat suits lately. So this is just a plain black mesh bodysuit. So it's see-through at the neckline and all down right here. It gives you a really, really good shape. It's not see-through at the crotch area. It ends right here. But then it comes down right here and is see-through on the legs. And then the back is just full solid. This motherfucker is so annoying to get on, but it's so cute. I don't even know which way is the back. So this one, as you can see, has a lot of cutouts. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do a try on. No, fuck that. I'll link a picture. <laughs> Next up, I just have this other bodysuit that's... Honestly, I'm not in love with it, but I didn't return it because I thought I could just use this as lounge, to be honest. I'm just not a fan of the line right here, like where it marks off my waist and below. I would rather it just be completely this fabric. It looks a little bit weird, but that's just my opinion. So the last thing I got from Solato is this bodysuit. The fabric is not the best. It's a little bit cheap, but it doesn't look cheap, you know? It's a little bit stretchy, so I like to pull this part up a little bit, and it gives you like that perfect cut, and it also comes with matching sleeves. Super cute. So the next star I'm gonna do is Sheen. Sheen? Shine? Shin? So I'm a very big comfort gal. I love things that don't take a lot of effort, but it makes you look put together. So these are kind of cargo style. They kind of have like that snowboard material, just not as thick. They definitely make that noise, you know? It's giving pajama snowboard. I don't know. I don't know. 
I like it. Follow your own rules. And the next thing I got is this gray t-shirt. It just says all roads lead to Rome. Very soft, very comfortable. It's oversized. I was planning this fit with like biker shorts and some, it's not my Air Force Ones, but something more, I don't know, something more fun. This jumper is so soft. I also don't own a lot of white, so I'm trying to put more colors in my wardrobe. <laughs> what does it say? Freedom. Oh my god. I didn't read this part before I got it, but it says facelift with a smile. Honestly, I only bought it because <coughs> white and green looks really good together. And I was also born in Florida, so she's a crazy. Then I got another sweatshirt, also very, very comfy. It gives me like very much vintage, like Lana Del Rey-esque vibes. I don't know, I thought it was cute, different. So I have two pairs of bottoms. Um, I love glitter. I love a good sparkle. They're also see-through. This is me in a pant, okay? So last clothing piece item that I got from Sheen, another pair of cargos. I don't own anything like these. I love all the detailing. Like there's straps and chains that go all the way down the leg. So fucking cute. Yep. The last two things I got from Sheen are accessories. Um, I got a tie, but it already broke and I haven't even worn it. Wait. I was gonna say this is very easily fixable. Yeah, I need to find this piece of fabric because this is really fucking cute and that would be a loss. So it definitely had a cute grunge rock star vibe going for it. Yeah, I'm really upset about this. I haven't worn it, so I, it has to be somewhere in my room. So the last thing I picked up from Sheen are these two pairs of sunglasses. I was actually only looking for the white ones, but it came in a set and these are really fucking cute too, so. These were only like $5 and it comes with a case. Cute. Oh, I lied. I also got the shirt that I'm wearing under my jacket from Sheen as well. Some random girl. So then I went to a, uh, what flea market? Was it the Silver Lake? When I tell you, I almost shit my pants. Again, I love shiny, I love glitter, I love sparkle, I love vintage, or like alternative grunge, like any of that stuff. And this is honestly a mix of all of it. So basically this part right here just goes to your waistline and then it just flares out at the bottom. Honestly, this is probably one of my favorite things that I got. I haven't worn this yet. I'm just waiting for the perfect moment because, you know, I want all the pictures. I'm getting bored, so I'm going to try and rush this up a little. So from Fashion Nova... I don't really have much to say about it. Just... <laughs> this is the back... It's a long sleeve. I don't know. Okay, I forgot. Shorts are also from Akira. I forgot to show them. They're the brand Puma. There's the, the Puma logo. I also forgot to show you these from Akira as well. I, weirdly enough, am not a big shoe purchaser. But when I see a good heel, it's coming home with me. So I did purchase these at Akira, but they're by the designer Azalea Wang. I was a little worried that the gemstones were going to be flimsy and fall off but they feel like they have a pretty good hold to them so okay i have about three pieces left but honestly i'm bored i'm just gonna show you this last sweatshirt that i got from PacSun, just because i really really like it i think it looks really really good with my jewelry the color is perfect the fit is perfect and then under the hard rock it just says madrid <laughs> i just realized this whole time that the fireplace wasn't on that was like the whole point of me sitting in front of the fireplace okay, well that was my haul for you guys i hope you guys enjoyed my impatience i'm cleaning up and i also just found this top that i forgot to bring out this is also from akira so the bottom of the top is a corset style and just a tie in the middle so you can tighten it, loosen it. I like my shit tight. Honestly, a very, very nice hot top. I have not worn it yet though because it just hurts so fucking bad. Look at this. You can literally see like the end of it and it's metal like that shit hurts especially when it's cut like this and it goes right under your boob like it just pokes. I don't know. I mean, I know one day I'm just gonna force myself to wear it. I really, really wish this was a comfortable top because it's genuinely very cute. All right, see you in my next video.